Aaron, interested in your take on these uh, bikers. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm okay with the bikers doing what they were doing. I'm not familiar with the laws in Texas as it relates to stunting, which you could maybe argue that they are stunting, breaking the law, and the police, you know, if they're lawfully asking you to pull over, then you should obey that. Uh, but it in and of itself doesn't really bother me. What bothers me is maybe if it becomes a larger issue, meaning if it's a larger issue of people just flipping their nose at police and, you know, maybe breaking into buildings. And I'm not saying it's going to go there, but I obviously hope it doesn't go there because if it does, then I think we're all into a little bit of trouble. But some guys popping wheelies on the highway, hey, just like Joe said, I, I, hey, I got to admire their talent. I'm a biker myself, so I can admire that. But if it goes any further as far as um, touting off to the police, then I think that we should maybe be a little concerned about that. Look at that, another uh, late-night miracle here on Court TV. We're finding common ground between Joseph and Byron tonight. Uh, uh, by the way, Joseph, I think Charles is, is kind of puts into words, uh, I think, part of the sentiment you were expressing. Charles writes, I think this is the freedom of right. They have not hurt anyone. And when we talk of freedom, this is its perfect definition. Kind of poetic there, huh, Joseph? I got to admit, that was well said. And I actually like uh, the way Byron said it as well, who, by the way, I have a lot of respect for because he cares a lot about his clients. But it's a lot of fun um, discussing with him because he brings it. So thank you for that and your, your candor and your honesty, Byron. And same, same to you, Joseph. I think it's great. In this day and age, too often are we having situations where people disagree and it gets violent or it gets disruptive. I love it that you and I can disagree about something and hopefully we still can make that steak dinner sometime. There you I'll, go. I'll give you that steak. <laughs> <laughs> that steak. Especially Vinny. I owe him a couple of them. <laughs> we've, got, <laughs> we've got one final comment tonight from uh, Eater who writes, well, they must get their license plates, arrest them, and book them for endangering the police officers while they were in pursuit. I'm also concerned about the other motorists on the road. Call me crazy. Anyhow, Byron Brown, Joseph Lowe, and Bremner, Thank you all so much. It was uh, great having you, you all on the program tonight. Please come back again soon. All right, folks, don't forget.